guys this is the part 5 of my AutoCAD tutorial series to tell, tell about the modify panel uh, first of all if you uh, still not watch the another video then you can uh, watch it I'll give the link in the description below this video and if you like it then please subscribe our channel okay, so let's start it uh, first tool you can see here is the move tool we just uh, move tool is used to move any object okay just select your object uh, which you want to move I want I want to move my plan then press enter and then specify a base point and you can move easily here okay now another option is you can see the rotate if you want to rotate uh, your object I want to rotate like my object here specify uh, the base point and you can see I am rotating object okay then another uh, tool is available is uh, is a trim okay, if you want to trim out uh, suppose I want to trim out uh, this line here okay then select the trim tool and then press enter and then you can see here the uh, red uh, cross is shown means it's trim if you want to trim out here you can trim out okay, this is very easy to trim out any edge okay now another tool here is uh, called extend okay if you want to extend like i want to extend this line up to this point okay then select these both lines and then press enter and then select which line you want to extend you can see the line is extended up to this point okay then uh, you can see another option is uh, erase it's called erase is it is work like the delete command okay delete button sorry and the another is copy if you want to op, uh, copy any object you can uh, copy from there okay and another is the mirror okay if you want to mirror any object i suppose i want to mirror my whole floor plan then it is easy okay i'm just mirror it okay first of all select the mirror and then select your object which you want to uh, mirror and just select this okay then uh, press enter okay then draw a simple line here you can see your object is mirrored and here you can see the two options so one erase source object okay if you want to erase this object source object uh, here you, you have to choose use uh, yes and i want to or i am choosing now because i want to i want the source object okay uh, i'm just delete this mirror image okay. it is easy to mirror any of your object or your entire plan okay now another option you can here see is that the fillet if you want to fillet uh, suppose uh, i have a line look like this type okay. if i want to chamfer my line at this corner okay then first of all select the chamfer command and then select your first object and then select your second object and you can see your uh, object is chamfered at the corner okay and just delete these lines okay then another command you can here is chamfered if you want to chamfer of your any object like uh, i have suppose first of all i have to draw any object like rectangle if you want to uh, chamfer this rectangle edges the, so this uh, corner just uh, select the chamfer and then select the uh, first line and then select the second line and you can see the object is chamfered here okay then another here is exploit if you have any polyline object uh, i am drawing here any polyline object see polyline and suppose i have object like this okay and uh, this is the polyline object this is not a uh, different line this is the uh, entire object and if i want to exploit this polyline okay so first of all uh, click here exploit and then select the object and then press enter and then you can see here now the polyline is become a simple line okay, now our object is exploited you can see here i am just delete this whole line okay now another you can see here stretch it's uh, work like the move okay then another if is you can see here scale if you want to scale out or scale in your object it is easy just click here uh, first of all i have to draw and object and just draw a little circle here if i want to uh, become this bird uh, too small and i'm to scale and then select object and here and press enter and then specify your base point i'm specifying here 
and as you can see the object is scale in or scale out i'm just click here you can see you can see you can see if you want to like uh, if you want to be the mall okay now you can see the object is become uh, too large but i want to make them uh, small and just uh, scale it again just uh, select object and scale specify your base point here and then uh, if you want to the op uh, if you want to the circle half of them just type here 0 0.5 and then press enter you can see the circle is become half of the original okay uh, scale is used like this okay the another is array if you want to uh, uh, group uh, group any of your object like this i'm telling you first of all i have to draw any object i'm just drawing a small scale uh, sorry small square i want to uh, array it like this uh, first of all uh, choose the rectangular array okay then select your object i'm selecting this square and then press enter okay so as you can see the group of our square is uh, generated and if you want to increase this column just click here and drag it you can see the column is increased we will decrease just drag it back you can see and if you want to increase or decrease uh, row you can click here also sorry you can click here also you can see row increase or decreases okay then uh, if you want to uh, uh, increase the spacing between them just click here you can see the spacing is increasing okay then if you want to spacing uh, between this you can see here spacing is also increase okay if you want to move just click here to move okay and if you want to increase the row and then column then click here okay and this uh, uh, this detail you can also manage here you can see on upside the column row and levels here okay you can also if you if you want to like uh, six column then six and enter you can see here now we have six and if you want to 10 row then just type here 10 and then enter you can see we have 10 row okay this is easy to use array okay and just close it close array and just delete the array okay now here another option is called offset here okay if you want to take up offset of your line and just uh, draw any line here like this okay like this if you want to any offset of your line i'm just select off or offset and then uh, uh, suppose uh, i am offset of uh, about three unit then three then type three and then press enter and then select your line and just you can see the offset okay the offset is like offset is work like this okay i'm just offset is uh, again you can see again is offset okay offset is generally used to make your wall like this if you want to make wall you can use this offset okay then another uh, some things i want to tell you suppose uh, i want to extend suppose i want to extend this line up to this point is it is uh, another way uh, except the uh, extend just click here and you can see the blue just hold your mouse here and you can see the length and click length and and drag here you can see your line is length and up to this point okay so thanks uh, for watching this video and uh, subscribe my channel to watch more videos thank you thank you very much